was very good that uh, uh, to uh, Japanese ministers and uh, to uh, American cabinet secretaries got together and uh, really sent an identical message to uh, North Korea as well as to China and others. And do you think, when you look at the options on the table for Japan, we understand the defense minister wants to increase military capabilities, but we are looking at a potential increase in defense spending with that as well, because we know it's expensive. And I have to ask you, given some of the ratings concerns we've seen for Prime Minister Shinzo Abe, do you think he has the political capital to push this through? Uh, this, uh, uh, the increasing of uh, roles and missions in the alliance with uh, already mentioned in February 10th uh, meeting uh, at the uh, White House between uh, President Trump and uh, pr uh, Prime Minister Abe. It, it, it's very clearly written in the uh, joint communique as well. So I think that's the uh, stance. But uh, how much will it be translated to defense spending? We have to see. Uh, as for uh, uh, the Japanese public, uh, I think uh, we know that uh, uh, because of the uh, threat that we are seeing, we have we can't uh, just be like before, and we have to increase uh, somewhat. But uh, how much, uh, to what extent, is uh, not uh, uh, decided yet. But I think there's a strong will on the uh, uh, government of Japan uh, that uh, we have to do a little more on this.